how to modify the behavior of the eraser and use the smudge feature in GIMP 2.6 on a Windows XP system. There are two features that have great artistic capabilities <coughs> excuse me, in GIMP software. If you have been working on a project and you would like to create something in a different way, for instance, when I do artwork, I tend to use, when I'm using paper and pencil, I tend to use the eraser more than I use the lead itself. You can do the same thing using GIMP software. Simply left-click on the eraser and determine the brush stroke that you would like to have. For instance, if you would like to add a wispy cloud look to your sky, click on this one, set the level to the far right for the scale, and you will see there's a large area that you can simply left click, hold your mouse in different parts of the document and left click, and it will erase what is there and Basically, you're creating artwork in relief. The other wonderful feature is the smudge feature. That is the one where there's a finger. Anybody who has worked with charcoals is familiar with filthying up your hands using your fingers to smudge the lines in order to create shadows and interest. This smudge feature works very similarly. You can set the brush to any of the brush types for behavior in the drop-down on the broad based, you left click and hold down the mouse button and drag and as you see it creates a smudge of the line that you've drawn. You can adjust the size or the scale of it by increasing it or decreasing it using the slider bar or the up-down arrows, and if you make it very large, you can create larger smears. You can adjust the levels for the way your smudge and your eraser behave the same way you can adjust and modify the way each tool behaves. And you can create artwork